electric solar panels installed when the Austin Convention Center was built in 1991 have not been working nearly all these years. But now they are. And KXAN's Doug Shoup explains fixing the problem would not have been possible without years of technological advances. A Department of Energy grant first helped pay for the solar panels on the east side of the convention center back in 1991. But just a couple of years after they were installed, the inverter that helps convert sunlight to energy broke and was never fixed. If we're going to put them up there, we should use them, save power, save money, and everything like that. Paul Bunshu with Ideal Power Converters says the reason the city did not replace the equipment was because it was too expensive and the power benefit did not outweigh the cost back then. The systems were not very efficient at that time. That's why Bunchu's company teamed up with the city on a pilot project to install its new 30 kilowatt patented inverter. At 94 pounds, it's much smaller than the convention center's original one that weighs 1,200 pounds. It's a much simpler logistics and installation. And uh, as the cost of the panels has declined, the installation is the most expensive part of these systems, so simplifying logistics is the key to reducing installation costs. The solar panels here at the Austin Convention Center are among the oldest in the industry, and after sitting idle, not working for 20 years, they are now generating energy again, thanks to the new inverter. Although the power generated is only enough to power about five homes, Bunshu says it's something. New panels would be roughly twice as efficient in their in their surface area as these old systems. Um, but still, the uh, value produced by the array is significant and it adds up over the period of years. This is one example of how technological advances from the past will continue to help Austin become the green city it wants to be in the future. I'm glad that they're operational again. That's that's what I'm glad about because solar is, you know, just using solar power is way better than just using energy. Ideal Power Converters says it's currently working on larger commercial projects, one at UT as well as one in San Antonio. Those systems will be equivalent to powering about 50 homes. The company is finishing up industry certifications and will sell its inverters commercially in about a month or two. Live in the studio tonight, Doug Shoup, KXAN News.